Hello, welcome to Spurred On. This is part two of this week's Spurverts. I'm here with Craig Mitch. As always, I'm Rhys James. This time it is a transfers out special oh. because we are chopping the dead wood and we're getting rid of it. Then if you saw this, I imagine you did, we've got rid of Kapoo. Yes. Me right from our previous debate. <laughs> yeah, you were right. And his name has got poo in it, so exactly. I suppose he had to go. And cap. Don't know what you're saying. Anyway, <laughs> uh, so we had a debate. Who's best to go? Who's more likely to go? Kapoo or Stambouli? Uh, weirdly, they were both rumoured at the exact same time to go to the exact same club. Yeah. Kapoo is the only one who has gone, but Stambouli still potentially? Uh, I mean, Stambouli's been spotted in Oceana a couple of times in Watford. You know, I've got mates really? that have seen him in there popping bottles. You know, I've been there and it is an absolute atrocity. Yeah. so It's the worst place in the world. Just taking a page out of Jack Grealish's book, going Unless to places he shouldn't be going as a footballer, so maybe you will go Watford. If Oceana want to sponsor us, I will take back those comments. Yeah. I just, I love money. Uh, also, uh, Daniel Levy. Oh. Also, Paulinho's gone. So we've got Paulinho, we've got Capu gone. Yeah. There's two of the awful Deadwood from centre mid gone, which means we've got a bit of cash. 10 gone. million for Paulinho. How exactly. did he do it? How do you exactly. do it, Levy? Amazing. He's They've a magician. Been They've been leaving. Yeah. Um, not, not forgetting the Holtby money that we've got, uh, which is five point something, five point one, uh, and the Kyle Norton money that he managed to get. And I can't ago. believe that. I still can't believe cash. that. We've got thirty million to spend now. <sighs> not mention, not to mention all the cash we got from the TV deal. Raining in. Why aren't we signing Modric back? Oh, are we really going to still go? We don't want we Modric. Modric back. Or Bale, I take them both. Yeah. Bar, sign them all back. Let's get back to the glory days. Who else do you think needs to go? Quickly. Soldado's getting closer, it feels. Out the door. And again, I feel bad. Galatasaray are interested, Villarreal are interested. Yeah. And I don't know why, frankly, but it just feels like, you know, it is time we got to put down the family dog. Uh, and, uh, I'm not... Him, by putting him down, I mean send him to Galatasaray. I just want him to go. I don't like him. I hate the look of his face. I hate the way he plays football. I hate the fact that he hasn't scored any goals in open play for two years. Just go, Bobby. Just look go. at his face. Yeah, it annoys me. What, just, what? just that, just that annoying look that he has on his face every time he misses the goal. It's just mad puppy dog eyes. No, it's just, oh, I, just I can't even describe it. Anyway, speaking of yeah, Adebayor? let's let's go on to another Spurs striker. That. Um, well, Adebayor. Adebayor. They're interested supposedly. I mean, he's come out and said that he's not going, basically. He wants to kind of prove himself. He said a tweet, didn't he? Yeah, he said a tweet kind of dedicating himself to Spurs, saying he's going to show us all how great he is again. Oh, yeah, sure. Uh, heard it all before, mate. Heard it all before. But maybe, Sick of it. But the thing is, maybe he is, because uh, a video has surfaced that he has uh, recently converted to Islam. So congratulations, Adabi. Or maybe this will actually help him. You know what, if that helps? You know, with, with Allah's help, maybe he can go and score goals. Anything, anything to just score goals out of Bior. You know, that would be such a miracle that it would make me believe in Allah. Yeah, so if you can do oh, it, okay. do it out of Bior. Anything to make you score goals and find peace and stay off Facebook, I'm with it. I'm <laughs> and with you do it. look nice in your robe, to be fair. Yeah, so. Uh, also, Townsend. Trying to shift Townsend still, West Ham. Do you think Townsend should go? I just, I just, I just don't even think he's worth mentioning. Like, I don't want to waste Come words. Come on, man. He's a good squad player, Townsend. Is he? Is he? Is he, he a bit of pace every now and then. Is he the hit and hope guy? Is he? I don't know. He just but seems Bale a bit was forced. a hit and hope guy for half a year. What? And he started just, they started going in the corner. Right, he used listen. to smash it over the bar constantly. They Bale got is better. pure precision. And there was a time when Townsend took about 100 shots in a match and only two went on target. It's yeah, ridiculous. It is annoying. It isn't. Come it on, is. Mate. Just, I feel like Townsend, of all the Spurs players, is the one most likely to watch these videos. So come on. Mate. He's just yeah. letting us mixed race guys down. That's what he's doing. <laughs> oh. um, speaking of that, Moussa Dembele. He is supposed, supposedly has come out and said that his dream club is Bayern Munich. <laughs> <laughs> Laughing to speak is when you came to my comedy show last week, mate, actually, and that's really hurt me quite deeply. Um, Musa, is he serious? I, I guess so. The closest you'll come to Munich is the Audi Cup. Why are they having a beer cup? Beer festival, mate. That's close to his yeah. cup. Going to the bloody beer festival, wrapping up his gut. Anyway, mm. uh, thank you very much for watching. Uh, hopefully, we're getting rid of more dead wood. There's loads to get rid of, but we've got rid of some of it now, and it's good signs, and we're getting in some good players, so it's good. Well done, Poch. You say it? Pochettino. Okay. Right. And well done to Daniel Levy, or Levy, in the interest of fairness. Thank you for watching. This is Spurverts. Make sure to like the video if you liked it. Subscribe to the channel. Follow us on Twitter, at Spurred on TV, and we will see you next week. We've also had a lot of reactions from Woolwich fans. Uh, and not all of those reactions have been positive. So what I thought we could do is read out some of the best Woolwich YouTube comments that we've received on Spurred On over the last couple of months. So 